the Good Samaritan is walking by and it says beautifully here, he saw him and he had compassion. And just to say that the Lord sees you. Mm -hmm. And oftentimes I think when we're in this place, once again, we just don't feel seen. We don't feel known. We don't feel uh, loved because we're looking at it from the eyes of the wound or the eyes of the trauma. And it's a heavy thing to carry and it's real. Um, But the Lord sees you and he's moved and he moves towards you and he has compassion. It's like the Padre Pio line, it'd be easier for the world to exist without the sun than to exist without the Eucharist. So it's along those lines, like it'd be easier for the world to exist without the sun than to Jesus move past you in your trauma. And so he sees you and he knows you and he loves you and just desires to be with you. And a a part, I think, of the language or the way in which we can remind ourselves that he's with us is to think about a time you were previously seen by him. And just to keep you once once again in that place that is um, intimate, the place that is loving, the place that you can experience once again your sonship or your daughtership in the Father's gaze.